Brain surgery is a delicate procedure, and the doctors usually need all the help they can get. Luckily, help might be 3,000 miles away but still in the same operating room. The Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, has teamed up with AR, VR startup EDUCSIM to create a virtual avatar for renowned neurosurgeon Benjamin Worf. Benjamin Worf is an American pediatric neurosurgeon. Awarded a MacArthur Fellowship in 2012, Worf has revolutionized the treatment of intracranial diseases in very young children, focusing on hydrocephalus, a condition characterized by water on the brain. This collaboration aimed to create a virtual avatar of the neurosurgeon that is housed in MIT's Nano Immersion Lab. The goal is to transform medical training that is not limited by geographical boundaries and revolutionize surgical education. A scenario to explain this. Being over 3,000 miles apart, Dr. Worf's virtual avatar stands next to neurosurgery resident Mateus Vasconcelos in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Through the magic of virtual reality goggles, Vasconcelos watches Worf's digital twin perform delicate brain surgery on a doll-like model. An almost out-of-body experience, Worf describes it, akin to having an identical twin. This virtual interaction allows the renowned surgeon to function in two places at once. With this, he is providing invaluable training to medical professionals across the globe. It was my first training using this model, and it had excellent performance, said Vasconcelos, a neurosurgery resident at Santa Casa de Sao Paulo School of Medical Sciences in Sao Paulo, Brazil. As a resident, I now feel more confident and comfortable applying the technique in a real patient under the guidance of a professor. New brain surgery formed from knowledge gaps. The project was initiated by Giselle Coelho, Eduxim scientific director and a pediatric neurosurgeon. Frustrated by the lack of practical training options, Coelho sought to create a solution. Partnering with MIT. Nano's Deep Tech Accelerator Program, Start. Nano, EDUCSIM leveraged MIT's state-of-the-art immersion lab to craft Worf's avatar. To capture the nuances of a surgeon's skill, the team employed high-fidelity motion capture technology, volumetric video capture, and a range of VR, AR technologies. Worf visited MIT, Nano multiple times. Additionally, Worf wore special gloves and clothing embedded with sensors. He even operated on a physical baby model. All this resulted in a lifelike avatar capable of demonstrating surgery techniques with incredible precision. The avatar operates in synchronous and asynchronous modes. The avatar responds with answers generated by AI algorithms drawing from extensive research and a bank of Q&A provided by Worf himself. As MIT News reports, the potential impact of this virtual training is immense. Dr. Worf envisions avatars as a powerful tool, particularly for remote and underserved areas. It might never replace hands-on instruction, but the avatar project offers a newly cost-effective, time-efficient alternative for growth and knowledge.